Hello everybody and welcome, my name is Eric and today I'm going to be reviewing a cool little launch bag from F40 C4 TMP. Personally, I think it's an interesting name for an Amazon retailer. So let's get to it. All right, but so before I begin the whole tabletop thing, uh, the, I'm gonna call them as S40. Uh, the folks at F40 sent me this specific one because I chose it. They gave me a list of several of them actually. They seem to focus a lot on coolers, even electric coolers that plug into the 12 volt adapter to your cars. So you guys a quick clip of that. I thought it was really interesting. They have a pretty solid Amazon store, even though the name is quite interesting. They, they seem to be legit. So what I'm gonna do right now, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and bring you guys into a tabletop scenario. So you guys can see when I, you know, when I unpack it, you see everything unfold. Let's get to that. All right, so let's see what we got going on here. Let's open this up. Kind of put this to the side. Fold it. Hey, 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 all right. Now on the Amazon store website, they claim this to be completely waterproof. I'm going to put that to the test, of course, but I'm gonna first see what, you know, how many things fit in here. Let's, let's see what we got. We got a couple of pockets. That's very nice. Put like a water bottle type of here, deal here, something like that. Let me go actually get some cans and some water bottles. Stuff it all up. Okay, so here we go. All right, we can put here some cans like so. Let's form them in there. There's two in there. Oh, there's more space here. Oh, it stretches out. I can probably fit another one here. Let's see how much it fits. Let's see. All right, so we got here, we got about nine cans. Yep, there it is. I can probably put some more. There's one. I'm out of cans, but I got some water bottles over here. Let's see. There, there. Holy cow. Compact, small, and yet fits it all in. Ooh, that is very nice. Ooh, it's got a front pocket as well. Check it out. Ooh. It's got little straps in place. I can probably put utensils here. Let me see. Nah, that one's too, too big. Maybe it's spoon. I think a spoon will fit, perhaps. <laughs> you know what I was thinking? Sometimes when I go camping, I bring a lighter with me. That'll probably go in here. I can probably put the utensils, I'm thinking. Let's see? Pocket here? Let's see. Let's see what we got. Where's the zipper? There's the zipper. Got some utensils. If I go on a picnic, that's not bad. That's nice. Hey, it all fits right nice. Check it out. All nifty. Put the water bottle next to it, like so. It comes with this strap. So there's a couple of ways to carry it, either by the handle Oh, by the strap. I'm gonna go ahead and change change you guys to the standard angle from, uh, from the tabletop. I wanna see if I can actually put this along my shoulder, see how it looks. Let me get to that. All right, so let's see here. There's a couple of ways to carry. You can carry like so. That's actually quite comfortable. It's not bad at all. Put it on my shoulder like so. I think it's better. Let me see if I can actually expand. Yes, I can. You can actually stretch it. I think it works better this way. Put it around my shoulder like so. Carry it like that, huh? That ain't too bad. Perfect. So now I'm gonna put the whole water test. Well, more like the leak proof test. I'm gonna put this to the test. Let me get some water and fill it up. <laughs> All right, let's find out if this is truly leak proof. At a glance, it appears to be, but I'm gonna put it to the test. All right. Well, be it is. Because sometimes these type of coolers are stitched at the bottom, not this one. This is a complete seal. That it's cool. All righty, so now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pack it up 
as I would on one of my trips. For those of you who are new to my channel, I'll show you guys a few clips of what I actually do. I go camping on islands and go in rivers and stuff like that. And I used to bring a cooler with me. And I think this one is going to fit perfectly for what I do. So let me go ahead and pack it up the way I would. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys the way I pack whenever I go island camping or day trips and stuff like that. I usually freeze these small water bottles and put them in the corners like so. This is to make sure that the temperature remains cold and at the same time, they actually can be used as backup water whenever they melt down. And after I do that, yeah, stay in place, darn it. There we go. I put in the cans of, I like seltzer water. It's, it it kind of fools my palate thinking I'm drinking soda but without the sugar. <laughs> so I put the, I put the, uh, the cans like so. I might put one in the middle, another one here. And I put another one there. Just like that, something of that nature. And I might have a couple of sandwiches that I'll put in here. And I go ahead and close it. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna check the temperature real quick. I got my thermometer here. Right now the thermometer shows to be, right now is, the outside temperature is 78 degrees. I'm gonna stick it in like so. So we can, I can take a measurement of the current temperature inside the bag. Gonna give it a minute and then show you guys. Okay, let's go ahead and see what the current temperature is. We have around, let me see if I can focus a little better. Focus. <laughs> Just wanna focus. Anyway, right now it's at 64 degrees, right around here. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go ahead and start the timer. Because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave it off for about six hours or so, give or take to give a realistic lasting effect of the cold. See how long it stays cold inside. That's the plan. That's coming up next. Well guys, if you guys are wondering why this scenario has changed, it's that uh, my standard recording studio has been taken over by family members. That usually happens when you wait about six hours and 38 minutes. <laughs> I waited about six hours and 38 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off right now. I'm gonna see how the temperature is. See if it's still cold by the touch. Let's see. That's too cold. That's too cold. <laughs> Water bottles are kind of frozen. That's good. That means the temperature has been kept. Mm, let's see here. That one's very much still cold. Very much cold. I like that. There are one of the reasons why I waited about six hours average is because my day trips that I usually do when I show you guys earlier, when I go up on the rivers and I go island camping, um, most of the time I spend about six hours out there and then I come back. And that's the amount, the a lot of time that I that I usually use, and, and it's too cold. It passed the test. So guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. I'm going to put in the description below links to this uh, little cooler and many of the other ones that F40 offers. And thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys on the next one. Later.